Hey guys, so I recently filmed a couple of different videos with Joss's Volkswagen Surf Bus and it's quite unorganized and messy. We have all the accessories inside and everywhere. So today I'm going to be cleaning it up and reorganizing it to show how it can go from completely unorganized and messy to an organized surf bus. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. Be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner so you're notified every time I upload a new video. So let's go ahead and start cleaning this up. The front seats aren't as messy as the back part of the surf bus, but let's just go ahead and clean up some of those smaller accessories. So the first item we have here is her hearing aid case. It has her spare hearing aid. I'll go ahead and move that out of the way. And once I start taking items out of the bus, the compartments will start to open up and I'll be able to replace everything back in the right spot. The next item here is a packet of pretzels. And the last item on the seat is a pair of sunglasses. They're a blue color to match the theming of the bus. And there seems to be a couple of items on the floor as well. So the first set of items here are a pair of sandals. They're a part of her collection, of course. And there are two more items. The next piece is her water bottle. And the last item is the sunscreen. The sunblock is really small, so it's really great to place in smaller compartments. So the next section we're going to be cleaning out is this small glove box in the top corner. And there seems to be a lot of brochures and pamphlets. There's another compartment in the bus for those, so I've just moved them out of the way. And the two items I'll be storing away in the glove box is the hearing aid case and also the sunblock too, and there's a lid for it to open and close. Right now the van is set up as a night scene, but I want to turn it into a day setup with the small couch and the table as well. So what we need to do is we need to remove all the accessories on top and also underneath as well. So we're able to push that ledge back so it turns into a couch. So the first thing I'm going to do is grab some of those pillows. There's the throw pillows as well. The skateboard has rolled underneath and then there's a small hook attached to the side of the van so you're able to display the skateboard, which I think is a lovely addition. The next item is a dog food bowl, which we'll be adding in later on too and a really soft fuzzy rug. It's black and white striped, and there are some slippers as well, which we won't be re-adding to the bus since it's not a part of the scene I'm planning on setting up. The next item I'll be moving out of the way is Joss's phone, and that's actually a part of her accessory set. And then there's also a book from National Geographic, and it's about sea turtles. We'll continue to clean that back part of the van before we start organizing the kitchen section, but there's some coconut water which I'll be adding back into one of the kitchen compartments. There's also Joss's PJs as well, which we won't be re-adding to the van either. But they are definitely really bright and colorful compared to the rest of the items in her collection. There's also a blanket. It's a gorgeous light pink and orange color. And then there's also her sleeping bag too. The sleeping bag is quite a large accessory to store away, but there is a small storage compartment underneath the chair once that's set up. So that's where I'll be adding the item. An item that you definitely can't lose in the set is this extra strap. It doesn't look like it's important, but it actually holds the set together. So if you'd like to set it up as a chair, you have the strap attached across and you can move the mattress to wrap it around so it sits up like so. And then when you want it to lay down as a bed, you can remove the strap and then you can have it flat like a mattress, like how it is right now. And there's an attachment on either side of the set, so it's very easy to clip and unclip. One item that I was actually really worried that I had lost was Joss's laptop, and I'm so glad that I found it. It was just underneath all of the items, and I just had to look, but I'm really glad I didn't actually lose the item. And the next section of the surf bus we'll be cleaning up is the kitchen compartment, and this will be very easy to organize because there are a lot of different storage sections. So the first set of items I'll be putting away are some of the food utensils and also the food items too in this small little storage container. And the bacon actually ended up in the cooler. I'm not exactly sure why, so let me go ahead and add that in that storage compartment, and I can close that because it's completely full. In this middle compartment, it's meant to be a storage section for the cooler, but instead the first aid packet is there. I'll go ahead and pick up some of those smaller items so we can add the cooler into the right section. And this item here is the coconut water that I found on the mattress a while ago. And this item here is the coconut water, so of course that needs to go in the cooler and now everything can fit in the right spot. And the last step is to close that bottom door. Most of the accessories have been organized and put away, but now it's time to go ahead and set up 
Joss's Volkswagen Surf Bus. So right now I need to transform it from a bed into a couch. There are a couple of Velcro pieces on the mattress and also on the set itself. So the item does need to be completely removed if you're planning on transforming it into a couch. I'm just wrapping the mattress over the top of the strap to make it a little bit more realistic and so it holds up as well. There's a hook on either side of the van, so there's an option to keep the curtains closed or open. Of course, I'm going to go ahead and open those up, and I'll do the other side later on. I'll just make sure it's tucked in. And I also realized the bag is attached to the skateboard hook, so let me go ahead and remove that. And now that the bag is removed, the first item I can display is, of course, the skateboard because the hooks are meant to be for the skateboard itself. Joss loves to skateboard, so I'm really glad they did include this item in the set. And that small orange storage container is meant to be for brochures and pamphlets and there's a total of three included in the set and they're all themed to surfing and the beach as well which is great for the surf bus. There will be lovely items to display so of course I'll display those right over there but there seems to be a few Polaroid photos already in the compartment. I might move them behind the pamphlets just so they don't fall out just because they are slightly smaller. As I said before, there is a storage compartment underneath the chair and it's more visible when it's a chair compared to when it's set up as a mattress. It opens and closes and I'm going to be placing the sleeping bag in here, but there's also some room to place another small accessory. So the next item I'll be adding in is the first aid kit. And some of the fabric is getting stuck while I'm trying to close it, but once you push it completely in, it should be able to shut close. And just before I open the table up, I have the rug right here to add. I really like it because it doesn't take up the whole space and it's quite small. And then the dog food can go in the corner. And the main feature of this setup is, of course, the couch. I already have the blanket over the top of it, but of course it's not styled properly. I need to go ahead and move it over a bit and have it more centered. So it's just looking a little bit nicer. And then I'll just be adding the pillows that I removed earlier. There's the main pillow in the middle, and it's a lovely orange color to match some of the items in the set. And then there's also two throw pillows as well. There are different pictures on them, and they're both themed to the beach as well. This throw pillow is slightly brighter than the other one. It's a bit more pink, and there's a palm tree on the front too. A great feature to the set is the table. I really like how it lifts and you can also store it away, especially when you're turning the set into a bed and you want a little bit more space for that. So of course I'm going to display the kitchen table like so and I'm going to move the chair forward so it's facing the table too. Of course you can display the table however you'd like, but for this particular setup I'm going to be adding in Joss's laptop over in the corner. And then the next item behind that will be the water bottle. I love how there's an orange and blue theme with a lot of the items in the set. And the next item I'll be adding is a yogurt parfait. It seems to have strawberries inside as well. There's also a spoon for that too. Right next to the laptop, I've just placed a plate down with a sandwich. That's definitely a great lunch option. And there's a small section on the side of the table too. So I'm just going to go ahead and add the pretzels. And since there's no more room on the table for some more accessories, I'll just add these smaller items over on the side of the chair. So there's Joss's phone and a reading book too. And last but not very least, there's a rack on top of Joss's surf bus for her surfboard. So there's a strap on either side and all I need to do is attach it to the surfboard and it should be able to stay in place. And the final step is to bring the surfboard a little bit more forward so it's more even. I'm so glad that Joss's Volkswagen Surf Bus is now all organized and clean. It was definitely very messy before. All of the accessories were everywhere. I was really worried that I actually lost a few items, including the laptop, so I'm so glad I managed to find it. It was just underneath all of the accessories, and if I had just cleaned it up, I would have been able to find everything. So here's the view from the back compartment. All the kitchen items are cleaned up too. I do really like how the door is separated into two different compartments, so when you're not using the kitchen, you can have the smaller door lifted, and then you can have the larger door still open. If you'd like to see an opening and review of the set, I do have it posted on my YouTube channel. If you'd like to go ahead and visit that, it shows an overview of all the items included in the set and some of the features of the Volkswagen Surf Bus. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.
Hey guys, today we're going to be looking at an item set from Joss Kendrick's collection. Joss Kendrick is the girl year for 2020. I did just want to say a huge thank you to American Girl for gifting me this item so I'm able to open and review it on my channel. This item here is Joss's wetsuit. There's only one item in the set, which is the wetsuit, of course. There's an image on the front of the box to see what it looks like, so let's go ahead and open it up. Let's go ahead and take a look at the wetsuit item itself since it's the only feature of the set. So the main item is blue, black, and green. There are some green stripes on the side and also on the top too. I really do love the stitching of the item since it's green rather than just having it a plain color. They added it to the design of the set. It's black along the side here and then the main piece is of course blue to match a lot of the other items in our collection. So there is a zipper that opens and closes the set. So there's no Velcro included to make it as realistic as possible. And there's a small little logo in the corner here as well. So this item would completely go all the way down 18 inch doll. It says American Girl at the bottom. It's a full wetsuit and there's no sleeves. You can see it's short sleeved on the side. So let's go ahead and take a look at the back of the set to see some of the details. Over in the back itself, very similar. There's no big design or anything, anything major. There is stitching along the middle here, and then there's stitching on either side, and also on the bottom too. Of course, again, you can see that it's short sleeve here, so there's stitching along the corner too, and the collar is also that green color to match the stripes that wrap all the way the back. Overall, if you're planning on purchasing the set, I would definitely recommend it since it's an item that's very realistic in our collection. So it definitely follows a longer storyline of surfing and loves to go to the beach. So this wetsuit is very ideal and I really do love the color scheme because it matches a lot of the other items in her collection as well. 